welcome to the Stupid History Minute. I'm your host, Keb Pound. Today, we're talking about the rubber ducky. The rubber ducky first appeared in the late 1800s, shortly after Charles Goodyear invented vulcanized rubber. Surprisingly, the first rubber duckies didn't float. In fact, they were solid, heavy, and intended as chew toys. Then in the 1930s, Two separate rubber ducky bath toys were created, and the association between rubber duckies and bath time was born. In 1931, Eleanor Shanahan of Maryland invented a rubber ducky that could emit jets of water from small holes. Then in 1938, Disney collaborated with the Seberling Latex Products Company to create a line of bath floater toys, that most popular of which were Donald and Donna Duck. As a side note, Donna was later renamed Daisy Duck in 1940. Then in 1947, sculptor Peter Ganin patented a duck toy made out of vinyl. It was patented bright yellow and included a squeaker. The toys were reproduced and sold across the world. Finally, in 1970, Ernie sang that now famous song, Rubber Ducky, You're the One. You make bath time so much fun on Sesame Street, which made it all the way to number 11 on the Billboard charts in 1971. It solidified rubber duckies as the bath time favorite for children around the world. Today, rubber duckies exist in every color, size, and design imaginable. Some are even considered collectibles. This has been the Stupid History Minute, and I'm Kev Pound.